Hey people, this is we 187 and welcome back to my Let's Play of Final Fantasy XII International Zodiac Job System in English. Don't grab that chest if you're playing the English version. Um, in the last video, we were walking around Rabinaster, and, um, we did some stuff, and now we have to go see Old Dallin, so that's just what we're gonna do. Yeah, that chest, don't grab that treasure chest if you're playing the US version, because you won't get the Zodiac Spear if you do that. Um... It's just one of the four locations. Well, well, I think I've gone to that before. We have here heard you were sent off to Nantbina. And I got out of there as fast as I could. But it was all worth it down. Here, look at this. My, my, my. Quite a treasure you've got there. Well, you know, I couldn't have done it without your help. So, there is more to discuss. You could have done it without Dallin's help. I'm playing. I know what to do. Van Ivanaren, a simple favor to beg of you. I was going to ask that kites to go, but I should think that you ought to do. No. No, I think you're just the one. Getting There's a philosophical fellow by the name now, huh? of Azalas, and I need you to bring this sword to him. That's. That's a sword of the old order. Speak my name when you arrive. That should be enough to get you in to see him. I've made a note on your map showing you where he can be found. Mind you, you are to deliver the sword to him personally. I will. Hey, Dal, do you think I could get you to do something for me? I need you to find out where Pinello is. I wanted to show her what I got from the palace, but I haven't been able to find her anywhere. Can you let me know if you hear anything? You can just leave that to me. Thanks, Dallin. And so it is done. But will it be enough to remind him of what the Order once meant? Okay, so basically, we got the Sword of the Old Order. I like how these people are always here. They're not family, they just like, like being with old Dallin. I want to read those books too. Um. Anyway, we got the Sword of the Old Order, and that sword is basically going to be Bosch's starting sword. But it has story purposes. So, let's head over to where we have to go, which I'm going to show you where we have to go. We have to go here to the Red X, and right now we are here. So, we got to go up here to the Northern Sprawl. And we go to the first bridge, and we make a left, and then another left, and then a right, and then another right, and then a left, and we are there. We got to talk to this guy. Um, his name is ba his name is Balzac, and he is basically the guard for the resistance faction in Rabinaster. I'm supposed I'm supposed to deliver something. This ah, I'm supposed to deliver something to a man named Basilis. This is the place, right? And who was it? Who told you that? Old Dallin. He said I have to give this to him personally. Does nothing get past that, Dallin? He has ears in every wall. He does. Alright, get inside, but not a word of what you see or hear in there. You got that? Cutscene time. Hmm. Then what do you make of Andor's proclamation? Are you suggesting they fooled even the Marquis? What if a judge killed the king, not the captain? That would explain everything, wouldn't it? In that case, the captain would be brother to a judge. How are we to trust such a man? Huh? Now there is the Bosch that I remember. Then will you fight again at my side? His word alone convinces me of nothing. I'd take his word over that of a mouthpiece Marquis. Then you name Rex liar with him. My brother was no liar! <sighs> Just the opposite. Rex was the witness they needed. They had to make it appear as if I killed the king. Rex bears no blame. The fates have willed it. So this is Rex's brother. <sighs> Your words may convince a child such as this, but they weigh far too lightly on the scales for my taste. Our paths will remain separate. Do you not think Amalia worth saving? I hold men's lives in my hands. I must see foes in every shadow. The night we moved against Vane, he knew. 
I will not chance such disadvantage again. I must treat you as I would Ondor, as I would treat any of better of the Empire. Then what will you do? Hold me here in chains? And he gives him the Some sword. Never change, do they? Listen to me, Bosh. Your cage may have no bars, but it is a cage. The eyes of the Resistance watch unblinking. Let them watch. Okay then, Vossler. I know something of cages. Okay, you watch unblinking in your creepy way. We'll get Vossler's actually like as a guest later on in the game, so. right. Amalia's in the Resistance. Then you know her. Sorta. We met just before we got sent to Nalbana. I've known nicer people. Our paths keep crossing yours and mine. It's more than coincidence. It's annoying. <laughs> I'm sorry. Poor Allow Bash. me one last annoyance, a favor to ask. I want you to take me to both here. Even caged birds need wings. This makes us even. Even? For Nalbana. We couldn't have done it without you. I like this part of the game. It's so, like, natural feeling. I don't know. When I first played it, it's, like, it's not light. The story is not lighthearted right now. It's just kind of, you know, I don't know. It's a nice feeling. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I'm weird. We have to get out of here. We need to go back into the city. So that's what we're going to do. We have to go this way. And this will take us, I think, to the east end, which is where we do want to go. There's a lot of cutscenes in this video, sorry about that. But we gotta get through the story. Oh no, we're in the north end. So, um, what we can do, we go just down here and we'll be where we want to go. More cutscenes, yay! Han's trying to make an Amalia attempt at being the main the character. Mine, mine had already died before that. The plague took them both. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. It's been five years now. After that, I lived with my friend Pinello and her family. Then, then the war came. I am sorry. You don't have to keep apologizing. Really, it's all right. I know it wasn't your fault. I see that now. You didn't kill my brother. It was the Empire. Yep. My brother trusted you. And he was right. Well then, Vaughn. You agree to accept Bosch pretty darn quickly, although I probably would have forgiven him long before now, but that's just me. Um, if you notice, we have Bosch in our party now. I didn't give him a job yet, as I really don't know what to give him. I had it planned out. I did. I had it planned out of what I wanted him to be, but I totally forgot, so we'll probably decide in the next video. Uh, let's just continue with the story now. Not much time left in this video. But, we gotta get both there and Fran. As I said, look at Miguel. What I am understanding is it's a Pinello because of you. What? What about Pinello? Oh, Vod. They've taken Pinello. And there was a note. A note for this Balthier. Come to the Museum of Mines, it said. It's the Gamnon. He was in Nalbana. If anything were to happen to that sweet child, why, I have her parents' memory to consider. You're going to go to her aid, and that's that. That's what you Sky Pirates do, isn't it? I don't respond well to orders. You do know that the Imperial fleet is massing at Bujaba. 
Fine, then I'll go. You at least have an airship, don't you? Just get me there and I'll find Pinello myself. I'll join you. Huh? I have some business there as well. An audience with a Marquis, by chance? Both here. Just take us, and this is yours. The gods are toying with us. Oh yes, for uh, So our next destination is Bujerba. That's what we, well, we won't be going there right, right away in the next video. We have some hunts and side quests to do, but we got all three and Fran back in the party. The video is just about the end, just about to end. But Gambin's note can only be referring to the Lusu mines in Bujerba. We'll leave it once. When you're ready, meet me in the aerodrome. So basically. That's what we have to do. There's only 10 seconds left in the video, so I'm going to cut it off now. But I will see you next time as we do some stuff and then go to Bujerba. Bye, everybody.